Welcome back to our channel. Today, brace yourselves for a spectacular journey into the heart of China's unparalleled innovation. Picture this. Scientific leaps that defy limits. Ventures that redefine what we perceive as possible. We're diving headfirst into these groundbreaking projects that push boundaries. Prepare to be awestruck as we uncover China's most audacious undertakings, leaving you breathless. Our first stop, the awe-inspiring Bahan Hydropower Plant, a colossal dam that stands taller than the most imposing skyscrapers. In 2017, China embarked on an unprecedented endeavor. Enter the Beihitan Hydropower Plant, one of history's largest hydropower projects. In a mere five years, China erected a monumental concrete barrier across the Yangtze River, soaring to an astonishing 289 meters high, dwarfing iconic skyscrapers. This powerhouse isn't just about height. It's a technological marvel boasting 16 domestically produced power units, each delivering a whopping 1 million kilowatts. The price tag? An estimated 26 billion pounds. The Bahan Hydropower Reservoir alone can contain a staggering $20,627 cubic kilometers of water, a feat akin to an artificial sea. Yet, the Yanks River hosts not just one, but six large hydroelectric power plants, Udong, Bahin, Silodu, Shanjiaba, Sanctua, and Dizaba. Operated by the Three Gorges Corporation, these stations collectively churn out a mind-boggling 300 billion kilowatt hours of electricity annually. Their impact? A reduction of coal consumption by a whopping 90 million tons and a cut in carbon dioxide emissions by 248 million tons. But it's not just about power generation. These marvels also play crucial roles in flood control, navigation, water management, and environmental security across the Yanks River Basin, forming an impressive 1-800-kilometer clean energy corridor. Their strides towards sustainable energy while safeguarding the environment are truly remarkable. Now, let's journey through another colossal infrastructure marvel, the world's largest structure of its kind, the viaduct, a pivotal segment of the freight rail route known as the Fan Railway Bridge Mangia. Spanning an astonishing length of almost 2,000 kilometers, this colossal railway bridge connects central and southwestern China with Inner Mongolia. Picture this, 216 piers forming this viaduct, the tallest soaring to a staggering 74 meters high. The entire structure stretches across nearly 8,000 meters, with foundations plunging an astounding 298 feet deep. What's the purpose of this colossal feat? It's all about transportation primarily catering to coal transportation to the region. Behold, a railway line built to handle trains weighing a staggering 20,000 tons, aiming for an incredible cargo turnover of 200 million tons yearly. Envision the sheer scale of movement facilitated by this monumental infrastructure. Now let's delve into a construction marvel that reshaped history, the Three Gorges Hydroelectric Power Station in a hub province. This project stands unparalleled globally. An awe-inspiring dam weighing a mind-boggling 65.5 million tons. Over 18 years of construction made it the heaviest project ever undertaken on our planet. Nestled on the Yangtze River, China's most powerful waterway, it emerged from the wreckage of a devastating 1991 flood that caused $30 billion in damages. A decision was made. A solution must rise, and rise it did. The project's cost, including resettling over a million people, matched the scale of destruction, reaching monumental proportions. Picture this. The dam hosts 32 power units, six nestled underground, generating an astonishing 100 terawatt hours of power. To grasp its magnitude, a thermal power plant would need to burn a staggering 50 million tons of coal to match that output. Despite its grandeur, the Three Gorges hydroelectric power plant boasts a simple design, a typical gravity concrete dam with a surface spillway. The figures? A colossal 27.2 million cubic meters of concrete and over 450,000 tons of steel shaped this 185 meter high, 2.3 kilometer long structure. Here's a staggering comparison. 
It took 85 times less concrete and 700 half times less steel to construct the world's tallest skyscraper, the Burj Khalifa, standing at 828 meters. That's the sheer scale we're talking about. The Three Gorges stands as a testament to human ingenuity, engineering prowess, and the sheer awe-inspiring scale of monumental projects. Now, brace yourselves for the Taihu Tunnel, an engineering marvel beyond compare. In just four years, and with an investment of tens of billions of dollars, Chinese engineers achieved the unimaginable. They breached Taihu Lake, creating China's longest and widest underwater tunnel. This remarkable passage lets you cross Taihu Lake in a mere eight minutes. Unlike conventional bridges that might disrupt scenic beauty, China opted for an underground express route spanning almost 11 kilometers, a well-kept secret highway and one of the world's longest tunnels. No more traffic woes, China offers a tunnel solution. While the Beipanjiang Bridge grapples with weather conditions, this underwater tunnel remains serene. It's one potential challenge. Drivers zoning out on such a straight road. To keep them engaged, thousands of LED lights line the way, transforming the journey into a dazzling light show. A driver's disco party, sans the dance floor. Building underground tunnels poses significant challenges. Take the Channel Tunnel between France and England. They dug below the waterbed. However, for the Taihu Tunnel, they opted to pump out water using coffer dams, creating a dry construction site. To maintain secrecy, ventilation shafts cleverly disguised across the lakey. Some resemble hidden islands, others mimic conch-shaped statues, and there's even one disguised as an ancient boat, an intensive game of hide-and-seek with engineering secrets. While impressive, the Taihu Tunnel isn't the world's longest road tunnel. That title belongs to Norway's Lerdal Tunnel. But China's ambitions soar higher. They're planning an astonishing 105.25-kilometer railway tunnel between Yantai and Dalian, dwarfing other tunnels. It's all part of China's silent revolution in high-speed rail, an unparalleled feat in transportation. Buckle up for an underwater adventure as China unveils engineering greatness, turning tunnels into captivating works of art. Now, let's venture into China's architectural wonders. While concrete and steel dominate construction, the Guangzhou Opera House defies norms. Designed by renowned architect Zaha Hadid, this colossal masterpiece spans 70,000 square meters, housing 1,800 seats, and costs a cool $200 million. What's truly fascinating is how nature inspired every angle and curve. Hadid drew inspiration from nature's canyons, rivers, gorges, and slopes, mirroring natural stones along the Pearl River banks. But wait, there's more. In Harbin, another stunning opera house emerges, a 79,000-square-meter wonder resembling a sinusoid. Clad in white aluminum panels, it sits on a marshy island connected to the city by a road bridge, seamlessly blending architecture with nature. Picture a low white wall merging with snow drifts in winter, enhancing its connection to the environment. These opera houses aren't just structures, they're cultural hubs hosting performances and celebrating theater as an art form. Prepare to be awestruck by the crown jewel of the Shanghai skyline, the Shanghai Tower, standing at a staggering 2,073 feet tall and costing $4.2 billion. It proudly claimed its place as China's tallest and the world's third tallest building upon completion in 2015. But it's more than mere height. The tower is a testament to China's economic prowess, boasting a twisty, spiral design formed by stacking nine giant cylinders, towering 138 stories high, an architectural marvel symbolizing China's strength. The Shanghai Tower's exterior isn't just glass. It's akin to a superhero shield. Clear glass on the outside and sturdy, hole-covered metal inside. This dynamic duo ensures coziness indoors, regulates sunlight, and champions energy efficiency. Speaking of energy, 
The tower isn't just tall, it's eco-friendly. It's a champ at conserving energy, contributing positively to our planet. In fact, it boasts a super fancy platinum certification for its top-notch energy efficiency and eco-friendliness. Step inside and brace yourself for a treat. It's not just an office building, it's a bustling world within. Imagine shopping, entertainment, and business all mingling like a gigantic urban playground. And for the daring ones, zoom up to the top. The view from the observation deck is truly out of this world. Even the journey there is thrilling elevators racing at heart-skipping speeds. Whether you're into stunning designs, dizzying heights, or just plain fun, the Shanghai Tower has it all. It's more than a building. It's a peek into the future of architecture, reminding us that the sky's the limit for human imagination. Chinese builders have taken on an epic challenge, reshaping landscapes with sheer determination. Instead of waiting for nature's slow dance, they've rolled up their sleeves to reshape mountains, quite literally. With a shortage of livable spaces, local authorities embarked on an ambitious project, flattening mountains to create vast areas for human settlement. How? By using soil and rocks from the mountains to fill valleys, expanding cities by hundreds of square kilometers of flat terrain. But that's not all. The Sunu area is gearing up for an even more jaw-dropping feat a colossal mining project to flatten another 700 hills in what could be the largest mountain-moving extravaganza ever seen. A groundbreaking endeavor with a staggering $2.5 billion investment aims to create space for a brand new metropolis. The hope? Boosting the region's GDP by a staggering $27 billion by 2030. Which project has captured your imagination? 